Welcome back. A church that's been part of Waterford's landscape since 1880 is on the chopping block. Leaders at St. Thomas Aquinas Catholic Church say they can't afford to keep it open and it has to be demolished. CBS 58's Michelle Fiore reports. This steeple is what you see as you drive into Waterford and the bells that chime are what people have been listening to here for years. That it could all go away is very upsetting to many people here. It's always been a, a great, great thing in the community and it's just sad to see it go. Don Harmlings lived across the street from St. Thomas Aquinas Catholic Church for over 50 years and says it'll be tough to no longer hear the bells chime. It's got, you know, character and it's like, let's make a parking lot, I suppose. You know, I don't want to see that. St. Thomas held its first mass in 1880 here at the corner of First and St. Thomas. For over a century, it's seen the people of Waterford through big moments. I, my sister and I received first communion here. My sister and brother-in-law got married in the old church. Jen Carwijk shared this photo of her sister's wedding inside the old church. No matter if it was if it's sunny or cloudy, when the light hit the stained glass, it was absolutely gorgeous in there. A growing parish led St. Thomas to build a bigger building on the property. The stained glass was moved into the new church in 2007. Church leaders say the old church building hasn't been used for mass in years, and financially, they can't afford to keep it and so it must be demolished. To me, it seems like there should be something they could do to save it. It's such a strong historical aspect of Waterford that to see it go, it, it would be very hard. A spokesperson for the Milwaukee Archdiocese tells us the last step in the decision to tear down this building is to submit a letter of intent to the archbishop. As of right now, the archbishop has not received that letter. Reporting in Waterford, I'm Michelle Fiore, CBS 58 News.